packing up the bikes. Hopefully we can find a nice bike trail. And we get to um, <laughs> I just wonder one day when you gonna take out that wood. Burn it. Yeah, it's, it's been petrified now. Is it called petrified? <laughs> That wood, that wood has been on the back of this truck ever since we, what, ever since we trip. Harley, Harley, oh my God. Oh my God. When we first got the RV, I paid for that wood. I'm going to get my money's worth. It's just wood. Yeah, it's it's just, wood. it's just wood, sir. It's good wood. Yeah, it took us it took us forever to burn the other piece that you had um, at the campground site. <laughs> How we looking? Okay, so I'm gonna go and get the rest of the stuff out of the bag. Okay. All right. Oh, well, it's now 7:45, and we are um, unloading. Well, actually, unloading the vehicles and putting everything inside the RV. So it takes it takes a fair, decent amount of time to. Um, as a part-timer to be able to get prepared. Usually we try to prepare um, three days before the trip. So like any last minute things that arise, we could um, you know easily get it done and then get on the road. But because we work full time, um, sometimes it just doesn't work out that way. So we will be driving a little late tonight. Well, actually we will be driving late. Well, David will be driving late, but I'll be up keeping him company. I don't know if you watched the last video with my husband talking about how we, I normally overbuy food and we end up having to take it right back home. So this time I did a little bit better. Um, I reduced the amount of cooking, um, the amount of meats. So I got breakfast food and um, some meat to cook on the grill. But other than that, I did pretty good. I stayed basic with the salads and juice and soda and water because I know that because I know that we're probably going to eat out a lot on this trip. And so, so I don't want to have to come back home with all this stuff because it's taking us a long time to unpack well pack the rv so all right i better get back to work before mr say it's time to go because it is here we go almost there Temperature has dropped drastically, wouldn't you say? Yeah. It has dropped and I had to put on my my jacket. So imagine that. Where are we now? Uh, we're still in Mississippi. 
Okay. Should be about to hit a Louisiana state line in a second. All right. Well, we are on our way. And this is what it looks like to pull over into Cracker Barrel parking lot for a few hours of sleep. Still fully dressed <laughs> with with other RVers. I'm all crooked with it. And with other RVers running a generator. Like they gonna camp out for the rest of like for the rest of the week. Boom we got you. <laughs> All right, well, <sighs> in the morning, good night. What were you just saying about this bridge and how, and what you think that's out there in the water? For those who are new to our channel, we are Miles Reviews, and we want to say thank you for stopping in. Yeah, thanks for coming by, and thanks to the ones returning. Yes, we are headed to, um, we headed Oklahoma, to? <laughs> Oklahoma City, for our right. 13th wedding anniversary vacation getaway. <laughs> Yeah, so we've been driving since, uh, what time we got up this morning? About 6 something? Yeah, about 6. About 6, 6 a.m. 6 a.m. And got on the road and been driving ever since then. Well, we, we stopped at, well, we stopped the gas. And then we also stopped um, at a rest stop for probably about 20 minutes. So you can get you a power nap. Yeah, get a little power nap. Yeah. So we just wanted to come in and just say hello and welcome to the to the channel and that uh, we'll share more of our adventure with you um, in the clips to come. Yeah, we're headed to go make some dreams reality <laughs> and see some crazy stuff along the way. Yeah, I'm hoping we can see some crazy stuff because this man has been looking for this craziness to, to put these appear. Glasses to work. Go go gadget glasses. <laughs> oh gosh. Well, stay tuned. Bones and I'm gay, so some hair. More than get a tongue, I got. Feels like daydreaming. No, I sit down. Man, I love my life. Sad, I change it. Man, I chumble. The chemistry is the number two. I'm just lost in the dark. 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 Tomorrow, I just don't. 
난 아직도 날 찾고 있어 매일이 매일이 날네 생각 하나 참 Everybody's driving pretty slow and attentive, so that's a good thing. So hopefully we can be able to make it to a oh, week. We have 112 miles before it's time for us to turn off. Oh, Lord. Well, we'll see about it. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment.